Well, yeah. <laughs> you know what? I mean, we were both standing there, and the beauty about Candace and I is they were two totally different artists. Um, and we're so we're both so driven and hungry for each other's careers, and um, I just felt like this is just the beginning. This is not the end of the road uh, for any of us. Um, so I'm, I'm so proud of her, and I'm proud of myself for even getting this far. I couldn't believe I was standing there with her at the finale. So you know, Candace is going to come out with her album in six weeks. Andrew has a new single. What's yeah. Well, stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> you could pick one person from the cast to duet with or to like record with on your own album. Who would it be and why? Well, Keith. Yeah. Because okay. um, he's a fellow country artist, and that would be an awesome collaboration. Tonight I had so much fun singing with him. How are you going to celebrate your birthday tomorrow? Um, I might do some sleeping <laughs> on, that, on that plane. Um, but, I mean, just... You know, obviously, uh, tonight I'm going to celebrate with my family because I feel like I have so much to celebrate. <laughs> Hi. Hey, what was your favorite moment tonight overall, like performance-wise? I mean, obviously you enjoyed your performance. You know, with yeah. Music, but is there anything else, even in the packages or anything that just moved you? Um, I, f I mean, honestly, the, the whole night was magical for me. And, um, and Candace, too. I mean, we just both kept looking at each other like, what are we doing? And um, the fact that I kept looking down and I would see my whole family, and my brother's here tonight, and I'm just so relieved to have the support that I've had. Um, so, yeah, I couldn't possibly just pick one moment. You had mentioned uh, you know, wanting to fix your parents' house. Yeah. Is that something that you, have you done any more planning on that? Is that something that you want to do right away? Um, all in good time. I mean, you know, it's, uh, there's, I think there will be a time for that. But yeah, we, we are definitely going to do that one day. Nashville is always so welcoming to, you know, new artists. And yeah. They're very supportive. Lucky Cummington and you had, um, you know, lots of different people come out. Is that kind of like where you think your home will be? Or where you think oh, yeah. I mean, I've lived in Nashville for 13 years, um, so I've adopted lots of family, and um, I'm a little biased. It's my second home, so. So we can get that country Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, I think before this whole journey, <clears throat> emotionally, maybe I had like a wall up on stage. And it's really taught me how to tear that down to connect with the audience. Because I feel like you have to on the show. You're just singing to a camera, and it's really important to connect. So um, I just feel like it's taught me to be a better performer. Now that it's over, what's the best part? Um, the fact that, well, the next step, obviously, you know, um, all of the relationships that I've created and the friends that I made. I mean, we get to go on tour together, which is crazy. We get, I, I get to go and tour. That's a little insane. Um, and then I want to just make a good record. That's all I've ever wanted to do. So, one last question. Your fans were tweeting you like crazy today. And really? And they know how is the support for you with all your new fans, with all the people that were with you from the second you auditioned? Um, I mean, not just my family, but uh, all of the, the, the following that I've created. It's, it's unbelievable. Um, they, uh, the Crease crew, Actually, they made me the, the best birthday video. And at the end of it, they knew how much the Children's Hospital visit meant to me. And they donated $50 each in my name to the Children's Hospital, which is so incredibly nice. So I've, I feel the love. Right here. Right here. Hi, baby. <coughs> when it comes to this whole process, what's been the most unexpected challenge for you, would you say? Um, the, I mean, I try so hard to live in the moment because I feel like the challenge was that it was so fast-paced. Um, but I feel like I did all right with, with, with doing that. Did you share anything with uh, Randy since had that moment with him on stage? Oh, yeah. I mean, I love him. I'm, I'm so happy that I got to be, um, you know, in the season with him. I'm so sad that he's leaving. But um, 
he, I'm sure he'll move on to do bigger and better things, and hopefully we can work together one day again, because I just adore him. Yeah. Can you tell us what your ideal album would look like? Look like? I don't want to tell you yet. <laughs> um, I mean, it's definitely going to be country, for sure. I, I want to be on country radio, and... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I can't believe that I get to go make that now. Do you want to do a crossover, though, or mainstream country? Um, I don't necessarily want to put myself in a box now, um, but whatever it is, it'll be Cree, I think. I hope. I hope you all like it. Have you talked to your sister yet? Yes, I have. What um, my, my All of my siblings are so proud. My brother's over here somewhere, and um, it's, it's such a, an amazing thing to, to have them here with me. It really is. I mean, I, Aretha Franklin, are you kidding? I'd, I'd sing to her video any day, uh, or with her video any day. I mean, I, I, I'm so happy that I can be one of the people in the world to say that I've sang with Aretha Franklin. That's pretty insane, right? <laughs> we kept joking about that, actually. I like that nickname, it's stuck. What was your initial reaction when you found out you were kind of going to be singing with her? I thought it was a joke. <laughs> I really, I was like, ah, oh, that's funny, y'all are hilarious. And then uh, all of us girls were just like, are you kidding? I mean, uh, Aretha Franklin is the queen of soul. What artist wouldn't want to sing with her? So we were so happy. <laughs> She's tweeted me, um, and I've seen some tweets where she's she's been really supportive. I love her. She brought me on her show four different times, and um, I hope to reconnect with her one day because she she was always so lovely. Yeah. Thank you all. I love you too. All the PFS. Thank you all. Thank you so much.